the accredited partners that are here today, and our ever-supportive media partners and friends, thank you for joining us this afternoon. First and foremost, the Miss Universe organization would like to express our deepest thanks to Kun Ann, to Raul Rocha Cantu, Olivia Kidoko, Mauricio Ra Rocha, and the rest of the Miss Universe organization for continuing to entrust us with the Miss Universe franchise. The franchise is owned by Empire, Hold Empire PH Holdings. We're also very proud to acknowledge Olivia Kido Kong, VP for Global Partnerships. She's the first Filipino to hold such an important role in the Miss Universe organization. You know guys, as you know, securing the Miss Universe franchise has proven to be quite nerve-wracking for so many countries the past couple of years. The uncertainty reminded us not to take anything for granted and fueled us to prove that their trust is rightly placed. And the person singularly responsible for securing the Miss Universe franchise is our president, CEO, Jonas Gafford. He's a visionary leader who has made Miss Universe Philippines a reality. A reality that so many people, including myself, benefit from and sometimes take for granted or take advantage of. Like many visionary leaders, he sometimes finds himself on being undermined and bashed unfairly. But he continues to stand confidently with truth on his side. No amount of money or connection stands a chance next to the passion and commitment he has demonstrated all these years for Miss Universe Philippines. That is a testament to his strength as a leader and humility as a human being. Let's please give a round of applause to Jonas Gafford. You know, Miss Universe Philippines was beset with business challenges posed by the pandemic and it, it, its infancy. But that was not a hindrance from realizing its innovative plans that would make a difference in the lives of people and in the industry. Miss Universe Philippines embraced digital platforms to highlight both the delegates, our country, and elevate pageantry. With this innovative spirit, Miss Universe Philippines has secured record sponsorship investments. Hi guys. We provide our partners with incredible success stories, all because of relevant and inspiring content for our shared audience. That's why we continually attract new sponsors and get renewals every year. In promoting tourism, we didn't just do postings of the slogans and of photos. Miss Universe Philippines and the delegates toured and visited Benguet, Bohol, Aklan, Palawan, Ilocos, Tacloban, Samar, to name a few. Through Miss Universe Philippines, songs and its artists have been popularized with songs like Magandang Dilag, Diwata, Kamahalan, Kulay, and Over the Universe. The tourism and, and runway video challenges showcase the world-class digital content creating skills of Filipinos throughout the country. Although the accredited partner system, a brainchild of Jonas, has been in place since the beginning, it has only been formalized in the past year, and by doing so, we have instilled a sense of responsibility and accountability to the APs, which safeguards the welfare of the delegates. The Miss Universe Philippines organization is also grateful, grateful for having the opportunity to help with worthwhile causes 
like Save the Children Philippines, Hope for Change, Autism Society Philippines. You see, Miss Universe Philippines doesn't just believe in women empowerment. We incorporated in our pageant and in the delegates journey. The first weeks of the pageant is dedicated to holding seminars and talks like mental health and financial literacy and trainings in media interviews and runway for all the delegates. Most importantly, we have produced phenomenal Miss Universe Philippines winners. All our winners have successful careers and continue to be role models beyond their reign. We salute you and we are so, I'm sorry, I got choked up because I really am so proud of the girls. Rabia Mateo, Beatriz Luigi Gomez, Celeste Cortesi, and Michelle Marquez D. They've shown that in Miss Universe Philippines, inclusivity isn't just a buzzword. They are the game changers that broke traditional ideas of what a beauty queen should be and inspired hope and courage for everyone and anyone to be who they are. <laughs> What's a pageant without a quote from Mother Teresa, right? <laughs> she said, I alone can't change the world, but I can cast a stone across the waters to create many ripples. As the ripples that the Miss Universe Philippines 2024 edition have already started to fan out and will continue to do so until our finals on May 22. Ripples started in over 55, 60 places in various provinces, cities, towns, and even Filipino communities from other countries. And yes, guys, we heard you. Because we have such an amazing lineup of sponsors this year, it means you can expect a show and a production that will surely put a smile on every pageant fan. Today is about the 50 delegates who have worked so hard to get to the nationals. Their reason or purpose varies, but one thing's for sure. There's only one crown and only one dream will come true. But we ask you, whoever emerges as the winner, I hope at the end we can unite to support, to support her all the way to Mexico City. Let us start this edition with love and end it also with love. Root as hard as you want. Cheer strongly to your heart's content for your favorites. But always remember to be kind. If you're truly a pageant fan that supports empowering women, then you will join us in the celebration of love for all. Stronger than ever on its fifth year, Miss Universe Philippines is a pageant that is built on a shared passion of empowering Filipinas, a love for country, strengthened by adversity, but always guided with heart, gratitude, and integrity. Maraming salamat po. Delegates of Miss Universe Philippines 2024.
to prove her worth by being on Miss Universe Philippines. Miss Universe Philippines Angeles is Joanna Marie Thornley. She is a fashion design student. And she hopes to have her own fashion line in the future. Miss Universe Philippines Australia. Miss Universe Philippines Australia is Kimberly Street. Wow, I like her. Wow. She is a finance accounting graduate, a full-time model, and an entrepreneur. She is a 
visual artist who has been painting for 15 years. Universe Philippines, book it not. Miss Universe Philippines, book it not. It's Natasha Jane Bahuyo. She is a BS Biology major in Molecular Biology and Biotechnology for a year. Miss 
Universe Philippines, Cebu.
is a licensed civil engineer and a passionate singer and businesswoman. Universe Philippines look fun. This Universe Philippines look fun is Ricky May de la Pena. She is she's a fashion, she's a fashionista and uses her love for fashion in supporting foundations close to her heart. She's a registered nurse who collaborated with Mandawi City in the implementation of universal health care. Miss Universe Philippines, Manila! Miss Universe Philippines, Mariveles. and events host. Miss Universe 
Philippines web is Maika Kablik Martinez. She exudes grace and poise, captivating hearts with her radiant charm and confidence. Universe Philippines Occidental Mindoro. Miss Universe Philippines Occidental Mindoro is Zoleil Melian Tanyo. She, is, she is a proud Mindawena who isn't afraid to take risks. Universe Philippines, Pagadian City. Miss Universe Philippines, Pagadian City is Hershey, May Sin. She is an epilepsy warrior to prove that sickness isn't an hindrance but a catalyst for growth. Universe Philippines, Palawan. Miss Universe Philippines, Palawan is Raven Doctor. She is an iron girl who grew up in a tourist spot destination in Palawan. Universe Philippines, Pampanga. Miss Universe Philippines, Pampanga is Cyril Mayumo. A Kapampangan who advocates the for the community fashion model. Universe Philippines, Pangasinan. <laughs> Miss Universe Philippines, Pangasinan is Grace Jenea Chua Lumad. She is an advocate and member. Alexis Antonio Reyes. She's a 38-year-old mom of two, former preschool teacher, athlete, and businesswoman. Universe Philippines, Quezon City. This Universe Philippines, Quezon City is Lorraine Ojimba. She's a 25 year old Nigerian Filipina who advocates for women empowerment. First Philippines, Quezon Province. Miss Universe Philippines, Quezon.
Amazon province is Maria at di sa Manal. She built a company at the age of 21 and now employs 8,000 Filipinos. Miss Universe Philippines, Quirino. Miss Universe Philippines Quirino is Stephanie Faye Herona. She lived in three major islands of the Philippines, from Luzon, Visayas, to Mindanao. Miss Universe Philippines is San Pablo Laguna. Miss Universe Philippines San Pablo Laguna is Eunice B. Deza. She is 23 years old and full of dreams. Miss Universe Philippines, Shargao. Universe Philippines Chargao is Jochelle de Ocampo. She was born in a very simple family, independent and a hardworking person. Southern California. Miss Universe Philippines Southern California is Janet Lynn Hammond. She's a full-time adventurer, not only in travel, but in the case she pursues as an immigrant, entrepreneur, and now a married woman. First Philippines, Sydney. Universe Philippines, Pangloba. Miss Universe Philippines, Pangloba, is Tamara Masir. She is a graduating accountancy student from the University of the Philippines, Pangloba. Miss Universe Philippines, Talisay City is 
Mary Josephine Poske. She is an aviation enthusiast and provincial. Miss Universe Philippines Toledo City. Toledo City is Kim, Irish, Placebe. She is a Toledona strengthened by time.
Dallas Philippines 2024 delegates. Wow, ladies and gentlemen, don't they all look lovely? But wait, we have one more special announcement to make, so please watch this. <laughs> 